yes. Where did, but where did Bambi meets Godzilla go? Because, and that was the time, and I'd like you to talk a little bit about this, when there was a real kind of alternative cartoon culture in America, and it was very much underground. Um, if you went to some of the uh, some of the universities, um, the bigger universities that were more radical, you would have known about it. But if you were at a small school, <coughs> if you were an adult, if you were a child, you weren't aware of this whole kind of underground movement going on. Um, but uh, so where where did where did Bambi go? Well, first it went on television. It, really, it was shown on television. Yes. Um, Who, where? It was shown on a on a local television show in Los Angeles. Um, so not ABC, NBC, or CBS? Well, right after that, then I was receiving calls from people like the Steve Allen Show and the Dinah Show and all these uh -huh. different um, shows. But the first show was Loman and Barkley, who were two ex-radio disc jockeys who had a show on a very bad television station just in Los Angeles. So which year are we talking here? This is 19... 69, late, later, yeah. uh, maybe summer of 1969, right after the picture was finished. I was, I was still in school, I think, when that, when that happened. But I worked for doing illustrations for advertising agencies. I, I just drew pictures because I could do it and make money because I was hungry. And um, so a person in that agency who saw it worked as a writer for that show and they put it on uh, the show. And then it went, it went from there. And, but then the cinema, 